Good morning. Before I continue on with my morning routine, I wanted to share my new everyday scent and the sponsor of this video is Dossier. Dossier sent me two perfumes to try out and they smell so good. If you aren't yet familiar with this company, it's pretty much a fragrance company that sells perfumes that sell exactly like luxury, expensive perfumes. I think the concept is super cool, especially when you're a college student and you don't wanna pay too much on perfume, like, they sell them at a much, 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 much cheaper price. I was sent Ambry Saffron and Gorman White Flowers. They both smell real luxury-like. They give that girl, they give it girl. I just feel like her every time I put it on. Initially, first smell, I did not like Gorman White Flowers, but now it's my favorite out of the two. It lasts all day. You smell it the next day. It's, yeah. Ambry Saffron is inspired by the famous Baccarat Rouge 540 and Gorman White Flowers is inspired by Victor and Rolf's Flower Balm. If you're interested, I'm definitely going to leave everything down in the description, the website, and both of the perfumes I got. Okay, let's get back into my routine. <laughs> okay, so it's six something in the morning. I went to sleep around midnight, so I'm tired. I have an 8 a.m. class today and I'm trying to have a productive morning. I need to straighten in my room. I'm trying to go to the gym. <sighs> but I also wanna look good for class. I still wanna beat my face and I still wanna look good. So let's just get started. <laughs> this looks a mess. Like if you know how to wear a braid to the gym, please help me out. Like, then I'm gonna wear these shorts. And I'm like rushing because Honestly, I don't even have a lot of time. It's the fourth day of classes for spring semester. And I was late to this class on Tuesday. So we're already starting the semester off that. Like I had to scooter to class and I was still late. So, and I'm not trying to have a repeat of last semester. I'm really trying to be, you know, early to class. That's what we want this semester. Um, oh, that was not fun at all. Um, I couldn't find one shoe. I just need to clean my closet up. I need more space. Perm tour? Hopefully soon. I'm trying to think of where my AirPods are. I'm honestly about to start crying because they were in the spot that I thought they were the whole time. But I just didn't look good enough. So, yeah, let's go. I could take my amino lead, but the fact that I only have 10 minutes to do a 10 minute walk on the treadmill, I feel like there's no point. We're just gonna do the walk. Cause. I'm so out of breath right now. I, I recorded on my phone in the gym for like two seconds, but I only recorded for like two seconds because there was too many people in there. When I say too many people, it was two people in there. <laughs> It's the way my room is still messy, but I don't have time. So that's what we're working with. This is just there. 
but we're gonna put it somewhere for now. Okay, I have to put my contacts in. Time reference, it is currently 7.33. I have an 8 a.m. at 8 to a.m. and it's like a 10 minute walk. I should ideally, ooh, ooh. <laughs> I should ideally be leaving at like eight. I just don't know if I have a lot of faith in that. Okay, that one's in. I just started wearing contacts by the way, so this is new. I've been getting really good at it. Oh, it's not going in my eye and I don't have time for this at all, like. I'm gonna brush my teeth. I hate recording myself brush my teeth. I think that's the grossest thing. I'm not gonna say it's the grossest thing to record yourself brushing your teeth. I just don't like watching it. So every time someone puts it in the video, I skip it. I've been using shea butter as my face like moisturizer. I think I love it. This, y'all. If you don't get anything that anybody ever says, get, get this. This mixed with any shower gel, body wash, like, not mixed with, but layered onto, so good. It smells so good. The first night I used it, um, I think I was at my friend's house. I put it on like after I got out of the shower, and I was going to sleep, and I'm like, something smell good. And the whole time, it's me. I got this from Target. It's the Cocoa Radiant Body Oil. And deodorant. I've been doing a full face beat for the past, what's today? Thursday. For the past three days. I'm not gonna do the crazy brow thing I've been doing because I'm actually trying to be on time to class. Where's my eyebrow pencil? Oh, okay. I've been having to take, or yesterday, to my Monday, Wednesday, 9 a.m. I had to take like my saw my makeup with me because um, the professor is making us wear a mask to class. I did that so I can like freshen up my makeup. But what time is it? It is 7.43. Like recently I've been like doing my brows to the full nine this whole past week. But honey, Today we don't got time for that. I don't know if I'm gonna have to scooter again. I'm not trying to get into the habit of scootering because last semester towards the end, I was definitely scootering because I didn't want to be super late. I feel like most of the time I did scooter, I was like late anyway, but I didn't want to be like overly drastically late. Like you should have stayed in your dorm type thing. You know, I set my alarm for like 6 a.m. I stayed in bed because like I was really contemplating whether or not I wanted to get up. I'm proud of myself because I ended up getting up and I did go to the gym and I'm proud of myself because like I'm proud of myself. But the way this college lifestyle is working, last night I was up not by my fault because I had a meeting for case study team I'm a part of and we were trying to get it done. We did not end up getting it done. But we also started talking. <laughs> I don't even know what we were talking about. Um, uh, <laughs> it's okay. I like to spread water on my brush. Sorry, I'm not looking at the camera right now, but I'm looking at it now because I just said. Anyway, okay. Yeah, I was up super late because I was working on a case study. But towards the end, for like the last two hours, I'm not going to lie, we were just talking about this other thing we're a part of together and just yapping away and complaining about Howard's financial aids. Howard is like, I love Howard, I love my school, but it definitely has its cons and I think it's the con that a lot of HBCUs have and why it's so like stressful being here and why a lot of people don't wanna stay. And that is our illustrious financial aid process. It's always terrible during like the first the beginning parts of each semester because there's always some messed up stuff my account is messed up but for my mental health I'm not even gonna go this week I'm just gonna go next week and deal with later I'm gonna say it's something you shouldn't do but I'm gonna do it because I don't I want to protect my peace right now um I don't feel like dealing with them on the first week of school and everybody's like angry 
and everybody as in the people that work with financial aid they're always like angry with attitudes trying to rush you out like please not too much hun. people's accounts are so messed up and i really feel bad mine is messed up too so i guess i feel bad for myself but some people's is like crazily messed up and mine i just have faith that it will be fixed by itself i have faith that i do not have to go up there and talk to nobody i'm gonna just try to give them two seconds to fix it did i do that good enough i don't know but i'm hurrying the rest of this week and whenever i decide to go next week i'm probably not gonna go monday because a lot of people are probably gonna go monday might go when do i have not that many classes wednesday i thought i had an easy schedule but i'm also taking like on a lot of different things so i just got like uh i'm just doing too much now i feel like i'm just doing a lot and i was doing a lot last semester but i thought i was gonna have more time to like rest this semester i'm not really sure about that but uh i can handle it I low-key think I like being busy. Like it's weird not being busy. I wasn't expecting to be this busy on week one of school. Like I had a meeting, I was in meetings from 3.30 to 10.30 p.m. yesterday. And that's the crazy part. And I'm also gonna be in meetings today. Like classes got canceled and instead of class, I'm going to meetings. But stuff has to get done and yeah. Um, where's my blush? I feel like I did a fantastic job at doing my makeup in this month time. It's not like beat, 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 like I've been beating my face, but it's it's real cute. Like this is what I used to do last semester. And because I'm really wearing a chill fit, like there's no reason to like beat my face like that. Also, if no one has ever told you, please wear blush. Dear black girl, wear blush. Because I was told when I was a child that black women don't need blush because they have natural blush. I don't know how true that is. It can be true, but the blush really pulls the look together. Personally, it feels as though my look would not be complete without the blush. And that's just period. I don't know who decided to lie to us and say don't wear blush because we don't need it. Like, granted we might not need it, but like it really pulls it together. I feel like it was somebody hating. I feel like it was somebody hating that started that and then told our grandmas that and then our grandmas told our mamas that and then our moms told us that. I don't know if that was just like me though. Was I the only one told that? I feel like it was somebody in the grapevine hating and saying we don't need blush and then somehow it got to my grandma and she said, I don't need blush. Anyway, we are painting the lashes. Or not we, just me. As you can see, my roommate is still not here. I didn't have a roommate all first semester. And it's Thursday, the fourth day of second semester. And she's not here. Where are you, queen? Are you okay? Like, I just hope she's okay. Because she's missing classes. One lash is on. It's 7.53. Oh my goodness, I got a comment on my YouTube video. This was a very thorough and informative video. My daughter was accepted early action for fall 23 and the information on scholarships is very helpful in this video. Great job. Aw, thanks girl. That's somebody's mama. I love that. I really love the comments on the how we got into Howard video. If you wanna get into Howard or figure out how we got into Howard, I have testimonies in my comments. People saying they got it because of my video, like, don't do that. Somebody that I love now, like, she's a freshman in the honors program with me. She said she watched my video, like, and she didn't know it was me. Like, that's so cute. I love that. Okay. This, I love this. But you just can't do too much because then it gets, like, too much. Um, where is my edge control? I've been forgetting to do my edges. <laughs> that's been the thing that's been forgotten, like, at least twice this week at least i didn't forget today at least it was like 50 50. i was also gonna try to wake up a little bit earlier today so i can have like buffer time to like record and be able to set up but honestly and truthfully i did that ish because it's 7 55 and all i gotta do is put on my clothes like literally don't pull me also i don't like the braids in the middle part i don't know what it is about my face shape but i hate it i've been having to change that like the past I don't know how long. Where's my eyebrow stuff? I don't have time for that, but 
Uh, I wanted to do something to my brows, but I can't find it, so here's the fit. This hoodie is actually built so badly. Like, why is it this short on my arm? This is my first time wearing it, so I really didn't know. The way it's like, ugh, this is from Shein, by the way. But I got it because of this. I thought it was cute. Honestly, I'm just gonna end up covering like this thing anyway. This is also from Shein. The hoodie feels cheap and like gross, and I would not recommend it, but I don't have time to figure out something else. We're gonna, of course, spray the Gourmet White Flowers. She smells amazing. First smell, I was like, ew, I hate this. Cause I thought it smelled too like manly and masculine and I like smelling really feminine. And it just didn't give that. It smells more fem feminine now to me. I think I'm gonna put on this necklace and I'm gonna hurry up and leave. So bye. Okay, so never mind. I forgot to put on my shoes and my bag isn't packed. So I'm putting everything in this black bag. I'm in a total rush. So this is usually how it is. And then sometimes I'm just like, I really don't care. And I just take my time. I'm not trying to be super late today or late at all, actually, for that matter. <laughs> and also my roommate might move in and I'm not trying to have her move in when it looks a mess in here. And she thinks I'm just messy. It's giving scooter day? Yeah, cuz. Okay. I'm tired. <laughs> it's hot with this puffer on. I don't know why I put it on already. Like, goodness, I'm hot. I'm sorry, I can't. I have to bring my Maybelline Fit Me and a beauty blender because, <sighs> just in case my makeup gets messed up. And this brush. Um. Yeah. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you like this video, make sure you like this video, comment on this video, and subscribe. Um, it is currently 8.05. I'm about to scoot to class, and hopefully I'm like less than five minutes late. <laughs>